Welcome to episode 1811, Stephen Feinberg, Secretive Private Equity Billionaire, Nine Lessons. This is an outline of episode 1811, lesson 1 to 5, it's lesson 6 to 9. Lesson 1 is secretive. Secretive billionaire, no interviews. He said he would punish his employees if they share his pictures. And two, he specializes in distress investing. I mean, Cerberus is a a big distressed investment. I do a whole bunch of different types of distressed investing. Um, we do a lot of investment in non-performing loan pools in Europe and Asia. And three, his quick start strategy. In the beginning, his was an obscure company. He gained exposure by hiring celebrities like Dan Quayle, former vice president under George Bush. And four, the most valuable commodity is information. Line, greed is good. It's another line from Gordon Gecko. It's that line where Gordon Gecko says, is the most valuable commodity I know of is information. And he's talking about the use of information, in that case, inside information, to make money President on Trump's investments. That Intelligence Advisory Board. And five, he's a Donald Trump favorite. He's a good friend of Trump. In 2018, he was appointed advisor on U.S. intelligence. Feinberg is... Um you know, the, the role has, has, is sort of shifting, I and mean, he, he doesn't have it yet, but what it might be is a role that uh, takes a look at trimming the fat at, at the Defense Department. Lesson six, he said he's overpaid. In 2011, he openly admits he and other private equity executives were overpaid. Lesson seven, his company, Seberus, it's a hybrid of private equity and hedge funds. Uh, you know, private equity and hedge fund shops. So both uh, traditional private equity and a lot of stuff in credit markets. Eight, how to get out of bad public relations from Freedom Group. In 2012, he sold Freedom Group, a holding company making firearms related to mass shooting to get out of a public relations nightmare. So nine is the largest single family home investor. The investment firm manages more than $55 billion in assets in its portfolio. It has more than 24,000 single family homes under management in 20 U.S. markets. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave your questions and comments below. Wishing everyone Peace and prosperity.